Scott with Yakima again. Let's get you rolling with your new single speed, single bike hitch rack. Single speed is sleek and light, secure and simple. Just what the solo rider needs. Install is easy and no tools are required. So let's go. Out of the box, it comes with a tongue, a tray, two threaded plates, some hardware, and a security wrench. First, place the tray upside down on a flat surface. Then, place the tongue onto the tray, insert a threaded plate, and align the outer holes, like this. Ready a screw with the lock washer and flat washer. Then insert it through the hole and thread onto the plate. Repeat the process with the other three screws, aligning the holes in the tray, tongue, and threaded plate for each screw. Then use the security wrench to tighten each screw completely. Assembly done. Let's get hitched. If you have an inch and a quarter hitch receiver, like this one, use the security wrench to remove the adapter screw and lock washer. Then remove the two inch adapter. Now, insert the tongue into your hitch receiver, making sure the hole in the tongue aligns with the hole in the receiver. Insert the safety pin, and tighten down the speed knob while gently rocking the single speed back and forth. Then, lock the knob with your included SKS key. The lock knob will spin freely, like this. That's it, you're ready to load up. The single speed will fit any bike that has 20 to 29 inch wheels and tires up to five inches wide. First, fold open the tray's wheel hoop and strong arm hook, like this. And tuck the wheel strap out of the way. Then, place your bike on the rack, making sure the tires are at pressure before securing. Now, bring up the strong arm hook, so the hook's one inch or less from your fork or brakes. And push down the hook until it's firm against your tire. Now, strap up that rear wheel. Time to lock it up. Pull the locking cable out of the strong arm hook and wrap it around the bike frame, like this. Lock with your SKS key. And remember, if you're drinking a post-ride cold one, the single speed has got you covered there too. Unloading your bike is even easier. Just reverse the process. Unstrap, release the hook, remove the bike, and go ride. When you aren't carrying a bike, make sure the wheel hoop is folded in, and the strong arm hook is secured to the wheel tray, like this. Time to take your single speed off. Simply pull the safety pin, unlock and loosen the speed knob, then remove and store your single speed for next time. Easy, 